And there's yet another case of extreme medical negligence, this one coming to light from Mangalore. Remember, just four days ago, we had told you the shocking story of Arnab Datta from Kolkata. Arnab underwent a surgery to save his life, but a blunder by doctors at a private hospital left him without a portion of his skull. And now we get you this case of Hafsa Rahim from Mangalore. Doctors at a nursing home callously left behind a pair of surgical scissors in her stomach. While Hafsa Rahim is a lucky young woman for four years, she lived in acute pain and on painkillers. This is an x-ray of uh, Hafsa's abdomen and that is a pair of scissors that you can clearly see there. Surgical scissors left behind in her abdomen when she underwent a surgery to remove fibroids. This at a Mangalore nursing home back in 2010. Rahim is recovering from a surgery she should not have needed in the first place. This one that she underwent on Monday was not to cure any part of her body but to remove a pair of surgical scissors that was left behind in her abdomen the last time she was operated upon in 2010. Then she had undergone a surgery for a fibroid in her abdomen at a nursing home in Mangalore. Subsequently, she constantly complained of stomachache and skin rashes. With painkillers proving to be of no help, an X-ray finally revealed the shocking reason. Armed with the X-ray report, the 31-year-old met Dr. Poonima Nair to get the scissors out of her body. Doctors, however, point out that Hafsa had been operated upon once before she came to their nursing home. The obvious hint is that the first surgeon must have left his scissors behind. Possible that first hakida gaya dalli alli baaki ullu side illi ullu dheer bhoodu ondu possibility ashte en idru odu open maadi aadha mele note nai kakku illi idhe anthe heidi Iga problem aagi dhe patient ike problem aagi dhe Yaar inda kakku aagi dhe adhanu it's a team effort Yava surgery aadhru obbri ghe honegaar anthe maadli ke aagud illa So obbri maadhi dhe barawasa illi nao adhanu ok anthe heidi kondu patient ike surgery mukda mele maadhi 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 Iga illi namma patient ike aagi dhe adhu bejara dhe vishayam Hafsa's family will approach the consumer court for compensation now. Meanwhile, a case has been registered against the two doctors at the nursing home. With Ratnika Sharma in Bangalore, Bureau Report, headlines today. And Ratnika, in fact, is joining us live with the very latest. Uh, Ratnika, is the family demanding the license of this private hospital which uh, dealt with this case with such callousness uh, should be cancelled? Uh, we believe they are following it up in consumer court and they are also seeking action against this nursing home. Uh, yes, Ruchura, I've been in constant touch with Hafsa's brother and he's told me that they're definitely going to ask for a compensation from the consumer court once the police investigations are done. In fact, they're uh, waiting for the police to arrive. Uh, yesterday, in fact, uh, Hafsa was treated in a different hospital in Mangalore and the scissors have been successfully removed from her abdomen. The scissors measure about four inches in length. Uh, the operation took about three hours and ended at 11 p.m. Uh, right now, Hafsa's condition is stable. She's in the ICU and uh, she will remain there for the next 15 days. All right, we'll follow her story with you. Thank you very much, Ratnika, for joining us for the moment.